Amen. Well, first of all, I'm uh, excited about being here, and I appreciate uh, the opportunity to sign this uh, legislation here at Des Moines Christian School. But first, I want to thank you in, for inviting me to today's School Choice Summer Meeting. Today is a big day for School Choice. In fact, this has turned out to be a banner year for School Choice and for all education in Iowa. Just last week, I signed the Education Reform Bill at North High School. The reforms in House File 215 will improve student achievement by improving instruction in our schools and increasing accountability. In addition, it also contains some most significant school choice provisions that have ever been considered in our state. Perhaps most notably for those here today, the education reform proposal included independent accreditation for private schools. bypass the burdensome government accreditation process when they choose another reliable accrediting body. These independent accrediting organizations often have even more rigorous standards than the Iowa Department of Education. Rather than face the time and expense of dual accreditation, private schools will now be allowed to use this streamlined process. In short, the legislation will make it easier and less costly for private schools to operate, increasing school choice for parents and for the students of the state of Iowa. The education reform bill also includes significant freedoms for those who choose to homeschool their children. The late session appropriation bills include important school choice provisions as well, including increased funding for textbooks. The legislature also accepted my $1.6 million increase proposed for private school transportation support. <laughs> Bringing the annual appropriation for that to $8.6 million. This brings us to the bill I'm here to sign today. This bill increases the tax credit for donations to school tuition organizations known as STOs, bringing that amount from 8.75 million per year to 12 million per year. in this tax credit since its inception. The bill also adds to the list of eligible donors, in addition to individuals, uh, LLCs and S corporations can also donate to STOs under this legislation. So STO STOs, as you know, increase school choice by providing scholarships for students that have financial need so they can afford to be able to have the choice to go to a private school of their choice. This bill represents another important victory for school choice in Iowa this year, and I'm really proud to sign it here at this special meeting today. Thank you. Very much. 